Welcome back, guys. Look how busy our airport is. And it's all kind of just about working. Right, I have, um, I've run the game on a little bit. I, I think it's like less than a day. Just to get us a bit more cash and to allow them to finish this off. Uh, what I'm going to do, first thing, I'm going to pay off our bank loan. Uh, let's decrease that, although I've got a sneaker suspicion. I might need that money fairly soon, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, maybe I should, like, let it run so we get some more money coming in. Okay, let's um, let's get on with it then. So, what do I want to do? Oh, I want to do a bit more building. So, we're going to build out there. Okay, cool. So, this is going to be our ticketing area up here. And then down here is going to be... This, this whole area down here is going to be security. I'm probably going to end up filling that area in as well kind of an idea this restroom actually needs to be a bit narrower it needs to be the same as these so let's see if I was gonna have a wall there so I'd need to take two of these out wouldn't I yeah it's already pretty busy though maybe maybe I should put another maybe I should double this up it's not a bad idea is it uh, okay, you know what? Let's uh, let's double it up. So we'll have so that'd be the door into there. So we'd have a door there. So the wall would be there, wouldn't it? Yeah. So we want it like that. And of course, not enough money. Of course, I haven't got enough money. Oh come on, let's have a let's have a flight come in quickly. So how big is that? That's nine by four that I need. Come on, come on. Give me a nice big fat flight come in. Oh, there's another couple of thousand. Vending machines are starting to bring in a half decent amount of money. Um, you know, I tell you what we can do. Now, this is a good point. Uh, I think we need more seating, because so, I put a, took out a load of seating. So let's put some let's put some seating in around the place while we're while we're waiting for us to get some more cash. So now, how do I, I want to do this? It's a very good point. So there's the main concourse. So. If we put seats at the end, and we put seats right up to there, so put seats there and seat, yeah, we can just about do that. All right. So we'd want, uh, well, I'll do the same thing here, I guess. So there, there, and there. Flip you around. And seats there, there, and there. Okay, and then we've got the same kind of deal over here, don't we? Yep. So it's going to be there, there, and there. Flip you around. There, there, and there. Alrighty. Uh, now, what are we going to put? Now, I think we're okay for in the environment. Let's have a look at the environment heat map. Well, actually, no. Well, no, if they're sitting there, they're actually in what's supposedly a not very nice place. So I guess we're going to... I was going to put uh, vending machines in. But no, I think we need to put... And also, let's have a look at the information. Yeah, it's not... Information is okay there. It's not terrific there, though. We may need to put some more info screens in. Okay, well. Um, so, let's see. What do I want? Objects, and I want decorative bushes. So, let's flip you around, and you're going to go in. There, there. Now, does it matter? I suppose it does matter which way round they go. Okay, and to go do you. So... There and there, and there, and there. Flip you around again. There and there. Yeah, I've already done that side. Yeah, this is actually going to have to be changed, isn't it? Because well, well, it, well, when we extend, that's going to have to be changed. So, right, just putting in those bushes. How's that changed the environment? Let's have a look. Yeah, a bit nicer now. Bit nicer. 
we'll probably put another bush like on this corner and then we can have some more stuff going on along here. Yeah, that'd probably be a good idea. Alrighty, let's go up here. I'm going to take out the walls that we don't need. So let's get rid of... Uh, let's get rid of those walls. And we'll get rid of those walls. Right, so now let's now let's sort out this restroom. Ah, I've got enough cash, I can do it now. So that sink, dismantle. That sink, dismantle. Get rid of that toilet. Oh, go away. Get rid of that toilet. And we'll need to get rid of... If you'll go away. Thank you. Now that's a trash bag. Oh, can I click on the... No, apparently I can't get that bin until they, somebody moves the trash bag. Oh, there you go. That's a passenger. Pass oh, pause. Garbage bin. Thank you. Dismantle. Right, so we'll put a wall across there with a... Yeah, well, let's do that now. Uh, what do I want? Build. And I want uh, walls. So I want wall, wall. And objects. Uh, garbage, garbage, garbage bin. There and there. And we want a door that goes flip there. And then zone, I need to change this. So back to there, don't I? Yep. It hasn't cleared that. All right, build. That does mean our restroom is out of order right now. Uh, I could get rid of that wall there, couldn't I? Clear. Uh, now, what I want, ideally, is kind of a corridor coming down here. Would be kind of nice. And I want it one, two... I, ideally, I'd like it, like, three wide. So, if I get rid of that... Yeah, that door's going to go. And build... Uh, not a foundation, a wall. Uh, I've got a wall there. Okay. So I'd want a se I want a second re restroom here. Build foundations. Do 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 foundations. What did I say? I said four by nine, didn't I? Four by nine. Cha Ching. And we're going to want a door there, aren't we? Yep. Build. Uh, not build. Objects. Objects. Give me objects. Thank you. Must be funny then. Where are we? Door. Uh, flip you around. So we want the door there, don't we? Which apparently I can't put in now. Build. Clear. I'm going to clear those internal walls. There. Thank you. Right. Objects. Door. Let's try this again. Flip you around. And now I can put my door in. Hurrah. Oh, there's a few. Oh, you're going to disappear. Let's hope so. Uh, you know, I'm going to pause it because we're, we're right over the beeping and it's driving me freaking crazy. I don't know about you. I hope you don't mind me pausing it for a minute just to just to put this stuff in. What do I want? I want garbage. Garbage. Here we go. So we want garbage bin there and there. There and there. We want uh, sinks and toilets. Sinks. We'll go one, two, uh, three. And one, two, three. Toilets. We'll pretend that this is a men's and a women's. It's obviously not, because they use whatever the hell. It's unisex. But that's what we'll try. We'll try and pretend that that's the way we're doing it. Um, and I do realise that these are actually offset. I don't know, maybe maybe I'll correct that at some point in the future. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll drive the OCD people completely crazy. We'll put that in there. We'll get a flight information, which will pop in, flipped around there. Boom. And then I need to remember to actually set the zone as a restroom. Bosh. Go. The thing is, I, I don't know whether it correctly zones that. Let's see. No, it doesn't. You've got to zone it again once they've built it. Come on, finish them off. Still got to do that and that and the three garbage bins. Yeah, you have to zone it after they've built it. That's that, come on. Flight information display, and that's all we're waiting for. And 
Bingo. There we go. We now have a second restroom. Hurrah. And there was much rejoicing amongst the passengers. Well, I think we should add some janitors then. As soon as we've got more of that stuff. We've got eight. Um, I mean, the place isn't, like, horrible. But I think let's add, like, one, two, three, four. Let's have another four janitors. It's not like they're that expensive. And we're making loads of cash. So what do we care? And we'll keep our place a little bit cleaner. Cool. Okay. So what the hell am I planning to do up here? Well, um, this 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 is my idea. So uh, what do I want? I want objects, and I want the ticketing desks, which are right down the bottom. Here we go. So ticketing desk. <laughs> now, I think this is going to be more for my aesthetic pleasure than it is for the actual. Like, I don't think the passengers are going to path the way that I want them to. In fact, I'm sure that they're not. But one, two, three then a wall, then a gap. Right, I want ticketing desk there, and I'm gonna have another ticketing desk. Yeah, am I gonna leave two gap or one gap? I'm just gonna have a one gap. Right, and then I'm gonna have another ticketing desk there and there, there and there. This is gonna be quite big. This is gonna be a, a fairly major expansion. And do, do. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to pause this while I put all this stuff in. That and that. And that and that and that and that. Okay. And look, there's people using them instantly. Okay, so that's that. I'm then going to do some queues. Now, the queues, the way I'm going to handle the queues, I think, is I'm going to have the queue there. But I'm going to go, I think, one in that direction and then up. Uh, do I, uh, I want to go that far? No, I think I want to come back one. Let's, let's come back to there. And no, didn't want to do that. I wanted to do that. And then we'll come down and like that. And this queue is going to be assigned to these four desks. So you are going to be assigned to there. You assigned to there. You assigned to there, and you, no, that's a workman, assigned to there. Right, we need, uh, we need a whole bunch of, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What, you know what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So that's 28 desks. That's 28 more staff we need. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Wasn't that fun listening to me count to 28? And I did it without using my fingers. Aren't you impressed? <laughs> I kind of am, actually. Just goes to show. Right, so they're actually using that queue. Lovely. I like it. Right, let's go queues again. We've got more queues to put in. So, uh, so that's the queue for those four. So now we need a queue for this one. So you're going to go one that way, up there, down and around there. So that's those four. So then you there, up there. Now we'll see. I don't know if this queuing system is going to work. I may have to modify it, but we'll kind of see. We'll give it a try. It may be an epic fail, but... You can only try... I mean, but that's the point. I mean, that's why you play games, isn't it? I mean, if you know exactly how to beat the game before you even start, what's the point? <laughs> like, really? What is the point? Uh, oh, my God. This actually works. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting to have to mess around. But that's actually quite nice. So what we want to do now is assign these. So assign you to the end... There and, and you. Wouldn't it be nice if they like auto assign to the nearest queue or something? There and oops. You and you. Oh, those aren't in yet, so let's let it run. Let's get, let our builders do a bit more building. Okay, that gets assigned to there. That gets assigned to there. 
Here we go. Next two coming in. Of course, assign to there and assign to there. That one. Oof, man, this is a lot of assigning, but this should give us massive capacity. Uh, in terms of ticketing. Uh, we've also got to put the ticketing, the, like the e-ticket machines in as well. The uh, the baggageless ticketing. So, assign that, and that one, and that one. Come on, and that one. How many more? Oh, last, last one. Thank God. <laughs> I'm glad I've only got to do this once. Right, and you. Oh, mind you, I've got to do it again with the with security, haven't I? Oh, that's going to be a pain. Right, assign you to there and assign you to there. Right, that's that. Right, we want some doors so that people can come straight in here rather than coming in here and then wandering all over here, which is pretty stupid, let's face it. So what do we want? Uh, we want doors. I guess we're going to have the large, the nice large sliding doors, which are a bit expensive, two and a half thousand, but they look cool and they'll impress our passengers and all the rest of it. So. If we put, if we put a door there and a door there, this is going to be like quite expensive, but I, I think it'll be quite cool. So, right, so we'll have doors all along there, so they can come in, and then they're going to be right by a queue, hopefully. Okay, and then now this is the bit that they're going to completely ignore, but this is just for my benefit because I think it's kind of a cool idea. Um, what I would like to do is have walls. Uh, oh, now, hang on a second. Uh, that we want them to come like either through here, then not there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then there. And then there. Now they won't. They'll they completely ignore this and, and walk straight down here, and they'll all come through this gap here. But. I'm going to try and encourage them not to, but I, I really don't know if I can. We'll see. So, yeah, and then that to there and that. Right. So, uh, let's let that get built. They do kind of want to come over this way a bit. Now, here we go. Here go the doors. The issue we've got at the moment is obviously the baggage. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about the baggage. So we've got all of our door, nice big sliding doors in now. So people can get dropped off. They can come straight into here. Come on, you. Yeah, there you go. You're straight into a queue. Good. Excellent. Although at the moment, people don't really need to queue because there's, there's so many ticket decks. They can just walk straight up to one. But people are queuing, so that's kind of good. All right. Are they using these? No, they're not. Okay. Well, I'm going to try and stop them from doing what they're currently doing. And the way I'm going to do that is by putting in some nice decorative bushes. So if I was to put decorative bushes, um, I don't know. Like if I was to put like decorative bushes like there and there, Now, I don't think that worked. Yeah. You know, let me put a couple in down. Like, if I put a couple in, like, there, then what happens? What I'm hoping is the people above this will say, oh, I can't go down there, I'll walk through there. That's what I'm kind of hoping. So, now, let, now let's see what happens. Ah, now people are going through there. Ha, 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 ha. Cool. So the, the people from here will walk through there. That's fine. And probably the people from the next one up will walk through here. That's fine. But, so, if I put in those there and there and there. Oh, come on. There and there. And there. And there. Um, yeah, I think that'll do. Um, can I put in here? I might as well put them there and there as well. Cool, excellent. Alrighty. Now, obviously, the, the baggage is going to be all to hell. And, like, but we'll do. We'll sort that out next. What I want to see 
I just want to kind of look and see. Do people like generally walk through these? Nah, generally they're just all walking down here and coming through this one, which is what I figured, but like a few of them are walking through the proper way that I'd like them to. Um, oh, I tell you, um, well, unless we could dissuade them further. Like, I don't know. Nah, I don't, yeah, well, I suppose I could put something like, nah, that doesn't really work, does it? Okay, I'm not going to worry about that. Um, what am I going to do next then? Uh, sh I've got to put like flight information terminals and make the place. I've got uh, t uh, ticketless machines. Yeah, uh, here we go. What do I want? Uh, where are we? Electronic ticketing. Here, uh, ticketing kiosk. <laughs> so, how are we going to do this then? I think, let's flip you around that way. Why don't we have electronic ticketing? Like, one, two, three. I'll leave a gap. One, two, three. How about we do something like that? And flip it around. One, two, three. Leave a gap. One, two, three. That's, I mean, that's loads of machines. One, two, three. One, two, three. These are like 2,000 a piece as well. Jeez. Okay. Um, let's get some more cash rolling in. One, two, three. Okay, we're getting these uh, built now. Oh, money's rolling in though. That's good. So we can carry on putting these in. So what I'll do is I'll put I'll put the rows on this side all the way down, hopefully. Well, like as far as we can get. And then when we when we get a bit more cash, I'll put in the, the machines on the other sides. But we're we're spending a lot of money right now. One, two, three. Come on, give me some more money. <laughs> I'm spending money so fast. And I've still got to do all the uh, all the baggage stuff. Man. Oh, well. Come on, come on, come on. Give me some more money. Where's that? Oh, well, it's midnight now. Well, ah, the next flight will be coming in in a few hours. Come on, you. Go away. Get the hell out. I should probably put some more baggage cars. It, it probably wouldn't be the silliest idea. But now, nah, I mean, this will be hooked up fairly soon. What the hell? Come on, come on. Make some money, damn it. I've got to say, it's. I think it's quite a nice layout. I might put some, I don't know, put some benches and vending machines and stuff down here. But it's just a shame that everybody's kind of walking down here rather than like going through the way that I want them to. We could do with little little barriers that we could put in. That would kind of solve the problem. Look at these look at these poor baggage guys. That 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 is about a hundred feet high, that pile of baggage. He's gotta to go to every individual desk and pick up the bags and then take them to the aircraft. Our aircraft are gonna be so late. Alright, let's put in these last three. One, two, and three. There we go. Okay, so now we've got 26,000. How much does it cost to put in, like, utilities? Let's see. Conveyor belts. Um, $300. Well, that's, that's pretty cheap. We should be able to do that. You would have thought. Okay, we're obviously going to change the way that things work. So... First thing, I'm, I'm going to get rid of these ticketing desks, I think. So, you. Uh, and that means I need to fire six members of staff. Well, that one's missing. Oh, that's the one that's gone off to drive the car or something, I think. So, do I fire the staff first? Yeah, you're fired. You're fired. You're fired. You're fired. And you're fired. And there's one missing, but I'll, I'll feel that out later. Right, that... Dismantle, I'm going to get rid of that bush. Uh, dismantle, dismantle. They really kind of need a drag and... Dr uh, like a, a drag box dismantle, don't they? Where was I up to? That's pending delay, that's pending delay. Right, this ticketing desk here. Dismantle, and that, and that one. That one, and finally that one. Hooray! Right, which means that we can get rid of this queue, doesn't it? Yes, it does. So let's strip that out. Uh, queues. Shrink queue. And it 
it's gone. Cool. Now, what I should do is get rid of these ticketing machines. And then we could reuse them and put them in here. Oh, that's a good idea. I should have done that. I should have done that, really. Like when I was like halfway down or something. But uh, but it's okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, we've got to dismantle all of these. Oh, no. No, that's... Oh, good Lord. That's a lot of dismantling. Three... Four. Let's zoom in and see if I can't get these machines. Ah, oh, there we go. That one, that one, and that one. Who man, this man. At least this should cut the costs down of putting the rest in. Oh, I can just get it. Yeah, just get it. And that one, and that one. There we go. I, I, I'm really going to be interested to see what our throughput is like when we sort all this out. Get rid of that and that one. There we go. Because it really should be like a big deal. Right, that's a lot to get on and dismantle. Get rid of all of that stuff. Here is our new ticketing lounge, which is super sexy and awesome. And seems to be working beautifully at the moment. Right, they've dismantled all... Ah, now... Now, the thing is, why do you have to set that to be ticketing? I, I don't have no idea. I, I don't know whether it has any impact or... No idea at all. But we'll get rid of that. So that's, that's not ticketing anymore. And ticketing is now this super awesome area up here. Cha-ching. There is ticketing. And I think that's fairly sweet. Awesome. Okay. So then we've got the restrooms down here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with that. I, I, mean, I could make that the CEO's. The, C, uh, the CEO and the CFO. Or COO and the CFO's offices. I could put those in there, couldn't I? I suppose. If I really wanted to. Um, okay, so now we've assigned that to ticketing. And yeah, people are showing up. They're still coming down here. I don't want them to come down here. Right, so this set of doors needs to go. So dismantle that set of doors. See, they're coming in here for a rest. No, you're not allowed to rest. You've got to go and get your tickets first. Then you can have a rest. Okay, so we need to wall that off. Right, let's, let's, let's impose our will on the travelling masses. There you go. Now you can't get in there. Ha, 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 ha. Grab a seat while you can, Granny. Not anymore. As soon as the builders get here, you're out. Oh, there's one. Come on, builders. Oh, there's two. And there you go. Ha, ha, ha. You're walled up now. Oh, they're all in trouble. They don't know where to go now. Right. So now you've got to go through these doors. Here we go. You're going to drop off. They're all dropping off at this end, but that's cool. When it gets busier and they're dropping off up here, then they'll flood through these. Oh, look at all these people coming up here. Now, why are those people coming up here? Okay. I think they've stopped now. Oh, no, this... Oh, it's this group of people here, well, which is fair enough. I think they were queuing for the e-ticket machines. And now they can just go up here. So, hopefully, with it, like, if we give this a minute or two, hopefully that'll all smooth out. And I'm hoping with this that... It should make everything a whole lot smoother. Okay, pause. Right, we have got... Uh, we've only got 21,000, but I think we'll try and do the baggage now. So, what I want to do is have half of the baggage going to this one, and I want half of the baggage going to this one down here. That is the plan. Can we make it work? I have absolutely no idea. Right. So, what we're going to do, I think if we take from i hope this works from these desks uh up there then along there and it's going to go into there now that means i'm gonna have to get rid of a bit of this and like so i just get rid of the whole thing oh i hope that's not gonna you know, i hope that's not gonna get rid of my plane uh, now that bit do i want that bit um, bum, 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 bum. No, to be honest, no, I don't really. So let's just get rid of. Let's get rid of that. You know what? Let's let's get rid of this. 
Let's do this differently. Well, I don't know. No, I'll probably end up still going around the back there. Yeah, let him, let him, let him get rid of that. And we'll sort it out differently. So, I've still got to get to the baggage carousels. Um, so, this one goes round there, round there. That's fine, for now at least. This one goes up here and needs to go into there. You see, when you're routing them from multiple stations, you, you can... Can you join them up like that? Well, apparently, like, I don't know whether you can or not. The hell? Oh, I was just demolishing. Oops. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Oops. Let's try that again. Yeah, see... From going going to the baggage carousels, you can join them up. It look, Well, it's, I mean, it looks like. Well, I guess we'll find out. So... Oh, no, you can't. Oh, what? I've got to put in... Ded I've got to have dedicated carousels for each one. Oh, come on. Really? Okay. All right. Fair enough, if that's what you insist on. Right, let's take that bit out. Oh, can I... Oh, I've got to cancel it, haven't I? Yep. Utilities, conveyor belts. Cancel project. So, we want... Come on. Yeah, that bit in. What I'll do, for now... Because, again, we're going to completely redo the, um, the whole baggage thing. If I put in... Uh, object. If I put in a baggage carousel, in, instead of putting it that way round, if I flip it round, whoops, if I flip it, no, I don't want it going in that side. Well, apparently, I've got to have it in that side. I haven't got enough money. Oops. Run out of cash again. There we go. How much do these cost? They're like 5,000, aren't they? 5,000? Yeah, 5,000. Need more money. Uh, let's see how they're doing with building the conveyor belts because I haven't got I don't think I've, I've actually got anything connected we got yeah we've got this whole thing that needs to be taken out let's get rid of that let's demolish that and that let's get rid of this so it's not confusing now I wonder if they can reuse that if that actually save us a little bit of cash be nice if it did okay so this is going to go up here to there oh and i put it i've connected it into the wrong place so i need to hook it up to there like that there we go right and then this line is going to come down here like this and now let's see, am I? You know, if I come down to like there and then come around baggage, maybe I should come, maybe if I should come across here and go down that way. Yeah, it's probably the smart move. Right, so let's come across here. So, yeah, so that goes around there and this is going to go... Where's, where's the bit that I put in? Uh, where's the bit that I put? Oh, there. So, if we do it to there. Oh, what the hell? Oh, because I've got no money. Oh, come on, give me some freaking money. It's so frustrating. Give me some money. Damn you. Oh, there we go. Now we've got a little bit of money, at least. So, and whether it's enough, I don't know. We'll see. So, where do we want to come out to? We want to come out to, I think, there. And then that goes over to... Oh, it still wasn't enough. Really? I need I need a lot of cash to come in. Should I... I don't know. Should I borrow some blooming cash so I can get this done? Um, yeah. Increase loan. Give me 50,000. So I can get this freaking... It's driving me crazy. Uh, what am I trying to do? Where's this? Let's... Let's extend up this up here for like the fifth time. So that goes up to there. That's going to hook into there. Right, so that will get our bags from the second set of counters to the second baggage. And then that goes up there. And... Um, <laughs> okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run it up here. And then 
So I'm going to run it down there and around there. And now I'll put in the... Yeah, I've got enough money so I can put in the next baggage carousel. You, seriously, I can't flip you around so you'll point down the bottom. God, that's a pain. Uh, what was I doing? Uh, utilities, conveyor belt, and then we can run that along and into... Oh, come on. Into there. Oh, what? I'm, I'm not out of cash. What the hell? You go to there. No, it doesn't want to. What the hell's wrong now? Oh, now you've gone in. And you've gone in. Okay, excellent. All right, I wonder if that is actually going to do the job and automate our baggage. It does seem to be. And people can go both directions. From, a, from like, one, like being in one place, they can go to either like the appropriate ticket desk. So people shouldn't have, have to be wandering like backwards and forwards. So, yeah, all of our bags are going down here. That's good. Right, now, this... Uh, let's assign some vehicles. Let's add like baggage car, baggage car. Let's have three. They only cost a thousand, so like who cares? That's probably overkill, but I, to be honest, I really don't mind. Do I need the thing is when I put those in? Do I need staff to drive them? I like I have no idea. We seem to have staff at all of our counters. Oh, there's there's one missing there. Oh no, you're there. Do you need like do you need staff to drive the cars? Because if you do, then I'd like to put some extra staff in. Why are you standing there instead of standing behind your desk, you silly person? Uh, let's put in some more staff. Oh, you've gone off to God knows where. I'm gonna put two, three, four. I'm just going to put a few extra staff in for God knows what reason. Right, we've had uh, loads and loads of people have just been kicked off a flight by the looks of it. At least one. How are we doing, status-wise? So, uh, that's today. Let's have a look at yesterday. Not tomorrow, yesterday. <laughs> so we had one, two, three, four, five, six flights cancelled, which is not good. We need things to be a hell of a lot smoother. Look, they're, they're all coming down here. Oh, are they coming down here to look at flight information? Oh, I bet they are, you know. Oh, okay. So when they walk in the door, the first thing they want to see is flight information, I guess. Oh, that's worth knowing, isn't it? Oh, all right. Well, let's get some of that put in. We've got enough to put some of those in. So, let's see. Uh, objects. That is seriously, seriously worth knowing. Uh, what do I want? Uh, flight info displays. So, let's get some of these puppies put in. Rotate. Um, why, can't, like, why can't I put you there? Okay, so I can put them there. So, alright, let's put you there, and there, and there, there, and there, there. And why can't I put it there? Like, seriously, why can't I put it anywhere there? What? Like, if I flip it around... Okay, so I can put it there. All right, well, we'll put it there then. Um, in between here, I was going to put um, some bushes and stuff, but I wonder whether we should have, like, more flight information displays around the place. Um... We could, like, like, can I put, I can put a flight information display there as well. Okay, well, that's where we're going to put flight information displays there as well. So that people have got loads of information about their flights. You know what, let's put those in first and see if it stops this stupid parade of people going backwards and forwards. Come on, builders, get those flight displays in. Here we go. Okay, now let's see. Yes, I think... I think that's going to stop it. There's still a few people. Okay. They've all gone. So now, the next arrivals, are they going to go down here? Or are they going to just be sensible? 
Oh my god, I think people are being sensible. I think. They're coming down here to the food dispensers, which is kind of cool. Oh, we could have food dispensers all down here. So they get their tickets, then they can have something to eat. We could maybe put benches on the, the back wall so that they could, like, yeah, grab something to eat, have a little rest. Then you can fight your way through security, which is frankly a nightmare. Yeah, okay. Well, you know what, guys? We're going to leave it there for, for this episode. Um, but that basically is ticketing. I want to put um, probably even more of these machines in. Uh, let's have a quick look at the, uh, the heat map for info. Oh, look at that. Info. Awesome. No problems with information. I think we'll probably put some, uh, some of these flight displays down this, this back wall as well. So that there's absolutely no issues. Um, I'm assuming the environment is pretty lousy. Yeah. So we, yeah, let me, you know what, let's, uh, quickly, quickly. Let's just put some quick decorative bushes in. So, there, there, and there, there. Uh, well, the wood, yeah, there should be one there as well. And these are cheap, so I'll put these ones in. And then there, and there, and, oh, not there. Cancel. Uh, there, and there. And there, and there, and I'm not sure what's going to go there. Right, once those go in, hopefully we should have a like, fairly decent environment as well. Yes, look at that. So we have got a very, very nice departures ticketing area. What do you think? Leave me a comment. Let me know if we can do something as nice for security as we've done for ticketing. Because I think that's really, really good. And then we'll do a similar thing for depart uh, for uh, arrivals down here. We'll have loads of baggage carousels all going down here. Oh, I'm very pleased with that. And the, the airport seems to be working, like, apart from security, which is obviously a bit jammed right now, um, seems to be working pretty well. Um, obviously, we need more baggage carousels, but we'll get to that. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, because I certainly did. Uh, come back for the next one. Uh, I'll catch you for that. Peace out.